In my lab, we study biological roles of microRNAs using Drosophila as a model system for human disorders. But what are the microRNAs? MicroRNAs are small non-coding RNAs that negatively regulate gene expression. Since their discovery only two decades ago, hundreds of microRNAs have been identified in all metazoans studied so far, and they have been implicated in virtually all biological processes. Even though we do not fully understand the molecular mechanism of microRNA-based regulation, nor do we know the complete repertoire of mRNAs each microRNA regulates, microRNAs have already developed as new therapeutic targets for many diseases. Therefore, when I started my lab, I wanted to use a powerful genetic drosophila model for a fundamental understanding of the complex relationships between microRNAs and their targets. The task appeared to be quite challenging due to the fact that most of the phenotypes encountered by microRNA loss are very subtle. We had to carefully analyze different stages, tissue and cell types. However, most microRNA loss of function mutants were viable, fertile and apparently normal in well-controlled lab conditions. Does it mean that they are not important? No. Our study showed that the specific microRNA-related phenotype can be revealed upon subjecting microRNA mutants to different environmental stresses and analyzing them at particular developmental stages. And this made us realize that maybe normal lab conditions where everything, food supply, temperature, day-night cycle are constantly controlled are not really normal and never happen in nature where everything is constantly changing. Our data show that the microRNA-based regulatory circuitry is accomplished via feedback and feedforward signaling. It allows harmonizing the entire gene expression profile in response to external and internal conditions. And based on our findings, we consider microRNAs as stress response managers. Interestingly, we also found that there are similarities in microRNA profiles under stress and disease. And we hope that future in-depth analysis of these stress and disease-related microRNAs will provide new knowledge about basic biological questions and will facilitate development of alternative pathways for treatment of human disorders using microRNAs as therapeutic agents.